Sinister short overview. Ellison is a true crime novelist, and he moves his family into a house where there was recently a murder. And as he watches these 8mm films of what at first looks like just families, excuse me, enjoying their spare time together, and is soon perverted into something much more sinister. Huh. I guess that's where it's from. Things start to yeah, get darker and creepier. This is a great horror movie. It does fall into some of the same terrible cliches, and the dialogue isn't always the best, but it really makes up for it with a really great thematic of voyeurism and just this, this attraction to violence, towards violence. And every character feels credible. The dynamic between the four-person family feels credible. Neither too cutesy nor too dysfunctional. The acting is really good. Ellison earns her sympathy in spite of being a genuinely flawed and very obsessive lead. The sound design is fantastic with these really great creaky floors and similar and it's a movie very much of atmosphere it, it keeps to a gradual pace with a really great payoff by the end of it try not to watch too many trailers because they give away too much there's not there are not that many plot twists in this movie to give away. If you like this review and want a more detailed one, check below, it's there as a video response. If not, it'll be in the description box. Please rate and comment, and hey, if you like this video, that subscribe button's just waiting for you to click it.